Hey guys, and welcome back to Luigi's Mansion. When we last left off, uh, we were encountering one hell of a blackout. And let me have a little gander at my maps I've printed out here that have everything on it that we need. Now, um, I think we've essentially found... Yeah. Basically found all of the extra stuff apart from a couple of blue ghosts that we will get to hopefully uh, later on and also Damn these bastards are loud um, And then also ah right. I know where we need to go now And to be honest it isn't a room that I would have thought about if I hadn't uh, looked it up So we need to go back through here now, yes, uh, we found all of the mice um, that we can, apart from the ones that appear by random chance. Now, obviously, 20% uh, <laughs> chance. Oh, God. 20% chance isn't bad, but I'm not going to fiddle around for ages hoping that one will appear. Um, Come on, guys. Come on, guys. What is this? Right. Ooh. Here we are in the wardrobe room. Come on, you. You're coming with me. You have just what I need. I've heard that you are the man that knows about a key that will get us into the basement. And we have... Oh, no. Come on. Oh. Oh, we savaged him. We absolutely beasted him. Jeez, Louise, big papa cheese. Now, any more money hidden around here? Yeah, I guess so. All right, cool. Well, make some of our coins back at least. Now, at least you only actually lose coins. You don't appear to lose... Oh, Toad's not here. Well, of course Toad's not here. Dude, I mean, come on, man. I'm here for a reason. And none of those reasons involve you guys, all right? So leave me be for five seconds, and you can piss off too. There we go. Now, I want to try... Yes! Okay. So, watering plants. Good to know. And how cool is this little scene here? With the... Um... Oh, nice. With the moon in the background there. It looks really good. It really does. That was it. Alright, not bad. Not bad little bit of extra cash in our pockets. Yeah, Mario's not here, Luigi. Right, now we can go down to the basement and turn the power back on. Okay. I'm not sure why they locked the door. Cheeky little gits. I mean, come on, guys. We're trying to do a thing here. Oh, God. You know what? Let's have a little look around. Oh, God, there is a few of them here. Right, two. Two on the hook. Not bad. Oh, we just got punched in the face. You know, these ghosts are pretty savage to poor old Luigi. Uh, right, you're coming with me, purple puncher. Oh, God. And you, orange puncher. Anyone else want to be smart? Try your luck? Get in. Come to Papa. Yes, what I thought. Yes. Ooh, uh, no. <laughs> I was like, oh, yay. Uh, uh, oh, no, bad. Don't want none of that. These buns don't want none of that, son. Right. Nothing? Um, nothing. Well, that's a whole load of disappointment. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Go on. Oh, we could have gone for a triple that. We really could have gone for a triple that. Ooh. Really? Really? No. Come on, Luigi. Right. Get in the frickin' Hoover bag. You two, you're coming with me. Guilty for being filthy, scummy ghosts. Come on. Now, I don't know in the Mario universe 
if ghosts are actually... I mean, these sort of ghosts. We know the, uh, the main painting ghosts are souls of the deceased. But these little ghosts that we catch and booze, we don't know if they're cr just mythical critters. Or, or if they are actually souls of the departed. I guess we may never know. Maybe Nintendo will, will clean up that bit of rich lore in the Mario universe at some point. Right, cool. So we have pretty much everything we need. Anything in here? Nope. Yeah, we've got the painting. We don't need to play with the painting. <sighs> Dude, you know, I'm not even going to waste time on you, okay? I'm going to sit here and drink coffee. Oh, God, I know. It's been a very long night, um, Luigi. Uh, we need to go this way, I think. Nope. It's been a very long night for you, Luigi. And, you know, for that, I'm sorry, but... Unfortunately, the game hasn't allowed me to save. Oh, God. And we got another tablecloth. Come here. Let's get these little buggers up. These little cheese munchers. Ghostly cheese munchers. Yeah, pretty sure we actually got the blue ghost in here, didn't we? Yeah. Came down here. We stole his soul. Now, actually, can we find out a little bit more information uh, about this gentleman? How do we actually navigate this? Right, B and Z to return. So, ah, C to select. Right, so, Hermit of the Darkness, Uncle, Uncle Grimmy. Uh, 45 years old. He looks way older in ghostly form than 45. Adrift in the darkness, he tends to keep himself... Uh, keep to himself, which suits the rest of the family just fine. It's not very nice. Uh, loves mussels and lilies. Why lilies? They symbolize purity. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I think we've got everybody else. All right, well, let's turn the breaker back on. Huzzah! Ooh. We have a boo. Oh shit, look at him. Look at this guy. 200 health. Oh, nuts. I'm not sure if we have to catch all of the boos, thinking about it, or if they're optional. Um, I can't remember. I'm hoping we can catch them all, though. I would like to. Hmm. New territory. New and improved. Is there actually anything in this room? Yes. Yes, there is. Oh, it sounds like there's some... Oh. Got ya. Yes. Come to Papa. Okay, I... Didn't think that thing was there, but cool. Purple puncher. Your ass is mine, boy. Nice. Anything else? Oh, wow. Look at these piles of dust we got here. Jeebus. Well. Certainly need some hoovering around here. Bloody hell. All right. Nice. And it, oh, God. Why are you hiding in that barrel? I mean, honestly. Come on, your fate is sealed. And that clears the castle out nicely. Now. Oh, hello. Well, we've got some gold. Certainly take the gold. There we go. I was going to say, I'm not exactly sure where that gold is. But we got him. Hmm. Hmm. There's no point in hiding. Something around here keeps flashing. Ah. 
Really? Oh, I see. Oh, really? Really, game? Really? You gotta pull that bullshit on me? Hmm. Not really a fan of being up here on the roof. Doesn't really help us that much, to be honest. Ah. Right, let's get this dude. Come on. Come to Luigi. Alright. No! Oh, son of a... Bitch. You know, these ghosts are getting a little bit strong now. Now, where's that? Oh. Oh, okay. That's a bit different. I'm guessing this is... Oh, no, this is not locked. Hey, friend. How would you... Oh. No, Luigi. How would you like to go see Mr. Professor Egad? Oh, this is going to be the first time we've saved it. In like... Ah, oh, you little shit stain. Come here. Come here, let me wipe the... Th oh, really? Really? You monstrously evil sack of shit. <sighs> you little dick cheese. I mean, honestly. Ah, all right, okay. Well, whilst that booze being an absolute fucking penis, five health he had left. Five. And he has to go run into a locked door because he's too much of a little bitch. Ah, right, well. There's not much we can do about that now, so we need to go all the way upstairs. At least there's lights on again. Now... I think we actually get like an option before we go to fight the final boss. I'm hoping that's the case because we know that there are ghosts that are not accounted for. And this, quite frankly, is unacceptable. Oh, can we water these again? No. No. Can we? Actually, talking of that, can we go water the plant out in the boneyard. Where was the boneyard? Uh, oh, that's all the way like, yeah. Nah, I'm going to say we probably can't, which is a big shame. Never mind. We'll get it on the next uh, playthrough of the secret mansion. Because that seems like the right thing to do. Ah, you know what we can do? Let's go have a little look at... Uh, our friend here, in the shitter. Finally, we saved the game. Oh, God. Now if the Wii turns itself off or, you know, dies or something. Um, which I, I hope it doesn't. Now, Wii's, right? This is one uh, thing of the lockdown that is driving me mad. The prices of gaming um, systems. Wii's, literally... Before the lockdown, right? You could pick up a Wii from anywhere. They are so common. It's unbelievable. And you can buy them, like, complete. With all the fixtures and fittings for, like, £15. Easy. 15 quid. Alright? For less than 20 freaking quid, you can have a Wii. And that sound, that's still sad. Oh, Nintendo. All right, then they're, they're not quite as bad as Microsoft for naming their consoles, but they're up there. So, yes, for 20 freaking quid, you can have a Wii. Now, now, you try and buy one now. They're nearly 100 quid. 100 pounds for a Wii. Um, how about no? <laughs> fuck, fuck that. Who is going to pay that for a Wii? Outrageous. I pay stupid money for good um, condition consoles, right? But I'm a sucker. And even I look at a Wii and think, um, nah. I like redundancy, okay? I like having a couple of each console laying around just in case something happens, you know. Um, 
But yeah, even I wouldn't. I actually need to buy a, a box to Wii at some point. Might get one of those red ones. Always wanted a red one. Um, back in the day. I mean, this one's modded, so technically the only moving part in it is its fan, because it runs all the games off the SD card. So hopefully it will, you know, last forever. But <sighs> who knows? Okay. But then that's like my uh, Wii U as well. It runs all of the games off uh, either the SD card for the GameCube games, because my Wii U plays GameCube games. Um, and that's something else that really bothers me about the Wii U. A lot of people don't realize this. Ooh, your Wii U, if you have one, can play GameCube games. And it can play GameCube games perfectly. But Nintendo never flicked the Switch, never allowed it to happen. Never allowed it to happen. In fact, the Wii U's disk drive is designed to not accept GameCube discs. So you have to download ROMs and put them on there. But there's no trickery involved. No bullshit involved. The system can just play them natively. Because the CPU and GPU uh, for the GameCube Wii and Wii U were basically the same thing. Just got a fraction more powerful each time. Come here, Bonesy. I mean, essentially, the Wii U's um, CPU is this, a very similar CPU to what they used in the uh, 2002 MacBooks. Which is madness if you think about it, but hey, that's Nintendo, man. Nintendo don't like spending money. That's not to say the Wii U's not a good machine. It is. It's fucking brilliant. And so is the GameCube. Uh, and the Wii... <sighs> Ah, uh, the Wii. Well, to me, the Wii is a GameCube <laughs> that has some other games as well. Right, where is my ghosty friend? Hmm, where are you? Where are you hiding, boo? Come to Papa. Are you in this table? No. You're not in there either. You know, noth if nothing else, this has really made me want to play the other um, Luigi's Mansion. 300 health boomerang. Yes, this guy's going to be a bit of a nightmare to capture, isn't he? 300 health. Oh my god. Oh, there he is. He's literally waiting for us right there. Ah, you little dick penis man. Ah. This is when I horrifyingly look over at OBS to find out that it hasn't been recording. Luckily it has been recording. Right. Ooh. Ah, there you are, sir. Come to daddy. Oh, I remember this room. Ah, where have you... Oh, man. Right, what are we doing here? Squeak, squeak. Hmm. Hey, stop looking at me. Uh, no. I will stop looking at you when you reside comfortably in my hoover bag. The valve. The valve. What valve? One on your back? No. Oh, God, money. We have some time pieces here. Hmm. Right, the valve, you say. Do we have a valve in here? Ooh. There's a fancy fella. Well, I mean, there's health there. Health's always good, I guess. The valve. What valve? What are we missing, Luigi? What are we missing, Luigi? Where's the valve? I mean, I can see tables and chairs. The valve, you say. And we have these creepy ass dolls. So, where is this valve? That's a clock. 
No. Nothing? Hmm. Is there a valve in the foreground that we can't see? Huh. The valve. Let's get the old Game Boy out, see if we can see a valve. You can see some disembodied heads. Some lights and some tools. Is that? Is there like a valve behind you? Is that something? No, there's nothing on the roof. Hmm. These are just more clocks. The valve. That's all they give you. They don't give you a lot of information, do they? Is that a valve? Nope, that's a creepy doll's head. I've been wanting one of these for quite a while. What, a creepy doll's head? Well, I mean, there's one free there for the taking, Luigi. If you want it. I can't see why you'd want it, but, I mean, hey, free's free, right? Hmm. Can't see anything else here to manipulate. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Uh, I guess. I don't know what that has to do with the valve. But, <laughs> hey, I mean, that works. Ooh, God. Hello. Uh, dude. No. No. You do not shoot that popper shit at me. How do we... Oh, I reckon... Can we suck? Yes, there we go. I kind of remember that. Oh, you little shit stain. Yeah, I kind of remember that. There we go. Got two loaded. Come on. We got him. We got him, Luigi. Oh, damn. Definitely need to get Egad to fix his bloody contraption. I'm saying this thing's faulty, man. This thing is faulty. Alright, we definitely need to try and concentrate on one of these at a time, I think. Nope. Come on. Right, let's get you down. See if we can wring your neck just a little bit. Don't know what kind of range these guys have. Seems to be fairly sufficient, actually. Right, let's grab the pearls before they disappear. We need that score, yo. Oh, man. He hasn't actually, like, got his health back yet. Or his thing back yet. Ooh, that hurts. Right, move, Luigi. Move. Come on, buddy. There's two. Two on the hook. We'll take it. Ooh, two's a little bit much for poor little Luigi here, I think. But green guy is now on his own. There we go. Isolate them and take them out one by one, Luigi. One down. What do you think of that, guys? Huh? Right, you're you're very weak. Dude, seriously. Alright. I'm not having that. Right. Oh, he's got 69 health left. This guy's pretty tough. Well, that doesn't matter too much. <laughs> This guy thinks weak. Yeah, he's weak. Get in the bag. Stupid toy soldiers. Right, you sir. You're hosed now, boy. You're so hosed. Your ass is mine. Consider yourself over a barrel. Whew, that was a tough fight. A tough but enjoyable fight. Now, who's left? Who have we got left? Oh god. Don't wanna play with that. 
Don't play with bombs, Luigi. Bombs are bad. All right, he's... Where are you hiding, little boo? Come to Papa Luigi. Uh... Oh, I can hear him. Now, if I was a little cowardly boo, ooh, I'd be here, apparently. Somewhere. I bet this one's got like 7 million health as well. Yeah, I reckon he's in this clock. Yeah. Right, yeah, another th time for the 6 o'clock boos. Yeah, another 300 health. Holy hell. Dude, please don't knock my coins. Okay? I need my coins. Ah, I need my coins. These boos just don't understand, man. Right. So where's this party bus heading next? Ah. Hmm. Alright, looks like we've got some boo activity in here. Ready for round two? If I can find you, you little pipsqueak. There we go. Now, where are you hiding? Are you hiding behind this? No, I guess not. You're not hiding under the sofa. It always reminds me of the Resident Evil Code Veronica uh, advert for the Dreamcast uh, with the woman hiding behind the sofa. I always thought that was such a cool advert. I had it in one of the Dreamcast magazines once. Come on, come on. Where are you? Here? I guess so. Right. Ooh, boomerang. This is boomerang again. Looks like he went back to his original hiding spot. It's so strange, you know. Sometimes, like, it looks like they don't even touch you. But you still get hurt. Right. Depth perception is... Oh, man. See, the fact that this is pink, I don't know if there's a key to what that means, the colours mean. Unless pink just means that you're in this room, which kind of makes sense, I suppose. Ah, hello. You are coming with me. Ah, oh, for really? Freaking really? Yeah, that's a fake door. Man, these guys. Honestly. I want to put strap on an ethereal boot and put it so far up his ass so you can taste it. Yeah, Come to Luigi. Come on, there's no point in resisting, boo. There's no point in resisting. You're only prolonging the inevitable. Uh, 300 health. Well, he's got 100 left. 100 health, that's doable. Come on, come on, come on, you little git. You, ooh, ooh, come on. Yes, you're mine. Your soul is mine. Yes, you can have this one. This one has been a complete pain in the ass. Okay. Now. See, this room is pink. I really don't know what the colors mean I don't yeah there's no legend I don't think so like if we go into the map yeah there's no legend to what any of this means which is really frustrating okay so where are we heading next don't know. Where can we get into? That's locked. Hmm. See, we've got yellow rooms. We've got green rooms. Hmm. Can we go anywhere downstairs? We actually... We can, sort of. But, 
that's going to have to be for next time, guys, because we are out of time uh, once again. So thank you very much for watching. When we come back, I would have figured out where we're going and what we're doing next. So till then, guys, thanks for watching.